clean hydrogen and we are going to call it clean hydrogen because we are you know we have a good team here they're here present here we're working with even standardizing hydrogen we don't have to call it green purple yellow pink mm -hmm. blue gray we have to work on standardizing hydrogen and let's call it green, clean hydrogen or low carbon hydrogen whatever it is hydrogen but at the end of the day we have to agree on standardizing the quality of hydrogen and make sure that it is acceptable for people to buy it if people have the preference to call it green we're also there we'll show you um, we've already started construction on new Aramco and Sabic and Ma'adin obtained the world first independent certification recognizing blue hydrogen and ammonia production. Ma'adin has successfully, has successfully certified 138,000 tons of blue ammonia, which represent nearly 40% of the global certified ammonia production. Commercial shipment from Aramco, Sabic, and Ma'adin left the kingdom carrying 50,000 tons of uh, certified ammonia to South Korea. Neom and Saudi Ground Services Company, Royal Commission of Jubail and Yamba, and Air Product are building hydrogen fueling stations in Neom. Six government to government uh, MOUs, including US, Germany, UK, South Korea, Singapore, and Greece. We've signed them this just this year, last this year actually, on bilateral arrangements to make sure that we work together on, on hydrogen. Eight pilot projects of hydrogen fuel cell based vehicles, buses, trains, and transportation application and sustainable jet fuel production, oil production, uh, fuel production were put together in Saudi Arabia. Actually, it's it is something that we're proud of because if we can succeed with that, we can scale it and become the role model as a Saudi, a Saudi Arabia for how hydrogen can help mobility. And we still have a competitive edge about it, by the way, because if we produce the blue hydrogen, we are going to be the lowest cost producer. If we go for the green hydrogen, to the dismay of so many, maybe, we're still going to be the low-cost producers. 